Let's see how to transfer website from Hostinger to Hostinger. It is very easy to transfer website from one Hostinger account to another Hostinger account and we can easily do it within few steps. Log into your Hostinger Edge panel. Now from the left menu click on websites. Now select the website that you want to transfer to another Hostinger account. And next to your website you will see this dashboard button just click on it. Now from the left menu click on files and then click on backups. Now from the top click on view backups. Now select the latest backup from here and then click on download files. If you are using WordPress, one more thing that you can do to download your backup is that log into your WordPress website dashboard. Now click on plugins, click on add new. Now search for WP Vivid. Install this plugin and activate it. Click on backup now. Once the backup is created, scroll down and here you will see the backup section. Click on download from here and again click on download. And as you can see that backup is now downloading to our computer. Now again go back to hosting your edge panel and here you can see that backup is now prepared. For the extra safety, download this backup also. Click on download and it will also start downloading to your computer. Once you have downloaded the backups, now click on main menu from here. Click on websites. Now click on this three dots button next to your website and then click on delete from here. Now click on this checkbox and then click on delete. And as you can see that our website is being deleted from this Hostinger account. So we will wait for around four to five minutes. So our website is now deleted from the old Hostinger account. Now log into your new Hostinger account. Now from here click on manage next to your web hosting and from the left menu click on this drop down button and select add website. Now click on create a website, click next. You can go with WordPress, hosting a website builder or mtphp slash html website. For now I will select mtphp slash html website but I will also install WordPress later on. Now we need to add our domain name here. Select the domain name. Our domain name is registered at the another registrar. That's why we are seeing this error. But that's not an issue if you are using hosting a domain or GoDaddy domain or any other domain name provider. So click on next from here. And as you can see that it's setting up our website. So we have successfully set up our website. Now click on auto installer from here. Select WordPress. Now enter your website title, email, username and password and then click on next from here. Now click on install. And as you can see that WordPress is now installing on our domain. WordPress is now installed on our domain. Now click on WordPress admin from here. Now again from the left menu select plugins and then click on add new. Now again search for WP Vivid. Install this plugin again and activate it. Once our plugin is installed, scroll down and then click on upload from here. Now select the website file that you have downloaded from the old website. Once the file is selected, click on open. Now click on upload from here. So our backup is now uploading to our new website. Our backup is now uploaded. Click on OK from here. Now again scroll down to backup section and here you will see the restore button. Just click on it. Now again click on restore. Click on OK. And our backup is now restoring. Our backup is now restored. Click on OK from the top. Once the backup is restored completely, you will be logged out of your old website because now you need to use new website username and password to log in.
Now enter your new WordPress subsite username and password and then click on login. And that's it. Now you are in the dashboard of your WordPress website that you have moved from the old Hostinger account. So this is how you can transfer website from Hostinger to another Hostinger account. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.